Today, I want to talk about your choice in focal length and why most of the time, I don't think it matters. But before that, I made a point of adding a little more of myself into my video because I've had a couple of people ask me why I don't get in front of the camera. So here's me grabbing some mediocre coffee on the way to my shooting destination. You can tell by the look on my face that it's every bit as mediocre as expected. Anyways, I ended up by the lake in Etobicoke, which is technically part of Toronto, I think. To start, I don't want to be made out to be a hypocrite while you watch this video. Yes, I own many focal lengths that cover anything from 12mm to 600mm. I own them because it's fun to use different gear at different times. Some may swear by one or two lenses in their main arsenal. Others like to switch it up. It doesn't matter. When I pick up my camera to do casual photography, more often than not, I end up with something in the 24 to 85 millimeter range. Something that's not too heavy or obtrusive. From there, I start walking and taking photos. I never really know what I'm going to be photographing. That's part of the fun. Sometimes I'll end up on a telephoto lens, and while walking I'll find something that deserves a wider field of view. Other times I'll see a subject way in the distance and find myself wishing I brought that super zoom. None of that really matters. The best focal length is the one that's on your camera right now. The ability to adjust how you shoot your subject. Changing your visual perspective can change your mental perspective. One of the things I find most attractive in this type of photography is how you are able to let go of expectations. Sure, the basics still exist. Time of day and weather is going to give you a base look or feel to your photography, but that's really where it stops and how you view the world on that day begins. Today, as usual, I chose my Fuji X-E4 for my walk. Most of my photos were taken on an 18mm lens, with one or two on the 50 to 230mm that I just so happened to have in my bag from a previous shoot. The beauty of taking photos with whichever lens happens to be on your camera is that it forces you to change your perspective. Is this a scene? Or is this an isolated subject? Neither is more correct than the other. It's freeing. It allows you to consider all and every scenario as its own individual piece, not dictated by which lens choice you made, only dictated by the subject matter. Once again, I'd like to thank you for coming on one of my photo walks with me. I hope you enjoyed it. If so, please hit the like button, and if you'd like to see more, please subscribe to my channel. Until next time, adios.